Hey there everyone, my name is Brian from the Guys Who Play Games, back with some A2XC Analog Funk. Now this episode is going to be a little bit different. Rather than getting anything done, I'm just going to be going through back up through all the levels and figuring out just what is left for me to do, because, spoilers, I haven't gotten everything. So we're starting off the Star Road, and I have no idea what's on the Star Road. For all I know, it's just another pathway, but... I didn't go down here because uh, I was like, well, I don't want to go down here. And what is the Star Road? It's an... Are you kidding me? Dang it! <laughs> By the way, you can go with these levels. They aren't really levels, more say. They're just little fancy things. But they're kind of freaky and unsettling in a way. You can even go inside this one and there's nothing here. But you can go inside. You can also go over to this one. No visitors! Man, I love this music. It's fancy. No trespassing! And, to finish it all up, I believe you can go to the one house near the town over here. Nothing to see over here. This one is a little Ukrainian dancer dude. There sure is nothing to see here. Anyways, see well, hey, look where we are now. We're back inside the subterranean airship. And we're over here with a little jetpack. Well, if you jump way over here to the left and rock yourself way over here, there's a little bit of a secret pathway up here. And what is up here, you say? Why, a leak and a secret exit. Ho, 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 I say, eh? Boom. So now we have another leak and an extra pathway. And where does this extra pathway go? Wow. I have no idea. But I know it's here. Question mark, question mark, question mark. That's curious. Uh. A short stroll, eh? Hmm. I would change to the legendary demo for this. With her red cat llama of death. Oh, well, this looks nice so far. Hmm. I'm not sure what to expect. Well, there's a goal. I did it! Whoa! Go. Uh, um. This is slightly terrifying. Get out of here so I can eat you, you creepy little critters. Jeez Louise, this is terrifying. So what music is this? A2S ASMT underground theme piece in oh. Well I did it. I got those coins and they magically disappeared. Oh no! Oh my That's slightly terrifying. Ah! Oh god, the submarines are blood! They're so bloody! Dear god! What is this? Ah, no, give me the midpoint! Thank you. Aw, oh, I can't keep Cat Llama. Or I might be able to if I... Uh, no, it's not happening. Did I even anything to jump on over here? So... Oh! What is this? Oh my god! What are these things? Oh no, it's... What the hell? Is that like a Lakitu with Raukau's... It's a Lakitu with Raukau's face, like... Like, sh sewn on or something. What is this? Ah! Where's the level end? No! I am in the pipe! Ah, get me out of here! Jeez Louise. Oh, hey there, demon dog. Oh... Oh, that was terrifying. And I don't think it actually accomplished anything, because there's no leaks in that level, but... 
Neat. Yeah, you could say that. Never look back, okay? Yeah, I could say that. Uh, I'll cut to the next thing. See you till then. And here I am back in that big cavern level where I missed not one, but two leaks. Yeah, I know, eh? What, you have to basically jump up there, probably using Raokau, then simply bounce away. Oh, thanks, game. Bounce your way across these spikes and bam, bleak. Simple as that. Now, let's us head over to the next area where we can find something. Well, hello there. You see this key? I happen to make good use of floating with Kud from the exit there. Mm hmm. Oh, whoops. Uh, I forgot that does that. Uh -huh. So, uh, boing. Uh, this is actually very close to the exit, too, which is kind of nice. So you plop down here, walk for a little bit. There's one Ferba, and there's the exit. And what happens when you do it? Bingo, bango. Kneel before the master. Whoa! Jeez. I guess that actually works. Oh, I got a boot. Man, Becky looks stupid on a boot. <laughs> Diary, undecember 54, 2076. Siege is upon us. We cannot last much longer. We have ascended the cavern in hopes of hiding, but we know we do not have much time left. Evil will take this land and shroud it in darkness. I pray that one day light will shine upon this day again. Bingo, bango. That's 86 leaks. That's quite good, eh? Coot hops his way to victory. Brilliant! <laughs> I shall cut over to the next bit of trivia. You, 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 you dig? Yeah, you dig. See you in uh, some undefined period of time. Yeah, this is a leak I didn't get. And to be honest, I'm not sure how to get it. So. Uh, Yeah, I, I don't know. I'm gonna hope to God I can somehow do this. I suppose that in order to do this without anyone seeing me, I could, um... Wait for this guy to go down. Well, never mind! That was almost done well. But then I died. Horrifically, I must add. Okay, uh... I think it's gonna be easier with just this anyways. Okay, Kood, come on. You got this, buddy. It's actually probably, like, the, for the best that I pop over here anyways, so... Ugh. Hey, the unfortunate thing, of course, is that you can't touch these guys, otherwise they kill you. So that's a thing. Okay, so what I'm gonna wanna do is I'm gonna wait for these guys to look away and I'm gonna rocket myself over there. Ugh. Okay. This is okay. I could do this. Possibly, maybe, yes, no. So what I should do is look away. Oh! Now just keep crouching, because if I don't, I die. Horrifically, I must add. Huh? Okay. This is another part where I gotta be careful. This guy over here is gonna look at me if I don't jump down at the right time. Now, how do I do this? But this guy's looking at me. Does that mean that... Does that not matter if there's blocks in the way? I did it! Yeah! <laughs> I done diddly do da date it! Midpoint, thank you for your sacrifice! I don't have to do anything like that again! Wah ha ha! Cliche jokes! Ho ho! 
uh, next league away or possibly secret pathway. I don't know, but I will tell you that I just pooped. Oh, 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 we are here at the castle of the above and elsewhere because there's a pipe pretty much right next to the start. I never did really go check. Oh man, he's throwing fish. I know that, but. Uh, well, now I'm playing with demo, I guess. See, right in the entrance here, there's this bat. And I don't like him, so I shoot a fireball at him. And then right over here, a couple blocks, and what's this? Ow! 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 Dang! Well, whatever, I did it. And I got whacked by a bat, like it was no thang. Dang, bro! Okay, let's be Mr. Cow. Wait, I have Iris with a cat llama? Eh, whatever, let's be cat... Let's... <laughs> yes, let's be the cat dude! Alright, well, what's in this pipe? Hey, haven't I seen this before? Wasn't this in the first game? In the Super Mario Bros. X thing? Emulate the thwomp and retrieve the skeleton key quickly! If you have trouble, put some skulls aside so you can kick them in quick succession. The skeleton lock went haywire. Well, I think. Whoa! Yeah, that's definitely. This is definitely some kind of reference. Alright. Where am I now? Well, there's some stuff happening. Ah! Block the grates to prevent proper bat circulation. Same goes for things that aren't grates, nor bats. Well, ahem. <laughs> It wasn't totally on purpose, to be honest. Uh, brr, brr, brr. So, does this respawn? Probably doesn't, does it? Oh, it does! Although, ugh, I don't really give a crap, though. Aha! I even get myself a nifty little thingamajigger. Okay. You're too late! This is all your fault. The metaphysical surgeon has taken the skeleton key before us. We're doomed! You've doomed us! One up, thank you. I'm the head scientist here. By the way, I'm not actually Peach. I'm only dressed like her, and I think someone misunderstood my request for a water fountain. <laughs> That's what they all say. God, that thing is ugly. I could probably kill myself somehow through that. Without the skeleton key, this castle is bound to collapse! Hey! But it grants the metaphysical surgeon enormous power, so we need the secret power to reclaim it. The malfunction of the skeleton lock opened all the hatches in our bat vent system. Instead of being steadily distributed as necessary, all the bats are flying out of them at once and causing trouble. If you go through this door, don't touch the spiky bones. I close out this door to the pit of obscenely. Obs obscurity. You don't want to fall into the pit of obscurity. I also write signs for you. Am I not helpful? I also write signs for you. Am I not helpful? Huh. Whoa! Whoa! Ack! Whoa! 
So you have come to thwart my wondrous plan. May I kindly ask you to depart? I don't even have time to crush you. I don't even have time to gloat. So don't interrupt me. You'll appreciate fruits of my labor as well. Sabotage switch. Don't press. Bad decision. Meet your demise, you fool. Skill shield. Protect me from harm. I don't think it protected him from harm. You vanquished him! Great work! Now drop the skeleton key to that fiery pit! Seriously, how oh, after all I went through to save that dang thing? Yes, unfortunately. It's necessary for the equilibrium and a new one will emerge regardless. Only in lava the key finds rest. Where's the key? Oh. Huh? Whoa, he's invincible! We built the bat cannon. Now save the key. This is important. Our savior. You saved us. Now scram. Thanks to you, our castle continues to thrive. The bat cannon. I always dreamed of this day. Booyah! Now what better to, you know, do after beating this hellhole? Check out the town. Which is hopefully the last secret exit I can find in the regular game, because otherwise I don't know. It's a desolate town. What is in this desolate town? Warning! Hostile creatures ahead. Ah! Blue surfing is a dangerous hobby. If I were you, I'd practice in a blue sack first. It's no fun for anyone to ride in too quickly. Well, I can't actually do anything. Ah! Oh shoot, they're insta-kill?! Well, you know what I mean. They, they don't give so much of a damn if I'm actually jumping on them or not. What's in this door? Rummaging through dead people's belongings is not recommended. To dig up a grave, press up the plants behind the grave. Ah! Oh! Sweet. Thank you. One up. Three up. Luigi, here lies Luigi's future grave. Congratulations, you've accidentally uncovered a murderous subplot. Fortunately, since Luigi hasn't died yet, you can't dig him up. You know, even though I've had about a year and I have to think about it, I still want neats to you, crime boss man Jello, on my tombstone. Alright, so let's head back. Doo doo doo. I can spin fly. I totally forgot about that. It's pretty neato. The town got decimated a long time ago. A strange person came. We greeted him. On a side note, these random portals appeared. We locked him away. I am the sole survivor of that fable day. I found a device that will let me change it all. It's on the table over there. Security systems activated! Ah! Yopple Gamma. Let's hope that this time not everyone hates the difficulty of my levels. In order to beat my levels, you have to drink a carton of currant juice. Get out of here! Oh! This used to be a fully functioning minigame room. It doesn't work anymore. Oh, sweet. But I gained the benefits of its reaping. Oh wait, what? I don't gain the benefits of its reaping. There's an invisible barrier up there. And a door that probably leads to nowhere, like a jerk! Portal, where are you gonna t- Okay, this is too intricate for me. Oh! That's the end. Okay, so let's head into that portal and see where it takes us. I say, wraparound is quite delicious, wouldn't you say? Yeah. Whoa! Whoa! I'm out of here. This is the door storage room. Proceed with caution. Whoa! I didn't mean to end up in here. Force me in there. You can't prove anything. Oh, this is the mini game room. So this is what this town is like, huh? Well, that's interesting. I 
think there's anything actually around in here. It's just a bunch of... Whoa! Whoa! It shoved me out! Dang it, game! Why you do this? Ahem, <clears throat> but... For realsies, maybe I should continue on. It seems like the door room is more of a joke rather than anything actually being there. I'm hoping that anyways. I don't want to, you know, press up on the doors for all eternity. Ah. Whoa, what is this thing? Eight flight. I have made a house here using bricks. I chiseled it out of the towers. You jerk. Oh, okay, there's another way up. E. Is that me? Monkey Shrapnel. Hey there, it's me again. Ever figure out the answer to my question? Well, ever hear of this guy named Rauko? Everyone here thinks that he's just the cat's meow, but he hides a terrible secret. That secret is censored. Uh, what was I talking about? Ah! What is this? Where am I? Ack! Huh, well I guess I can't go to the moon, the Canadian moon. <laughs> that was pretty funny, actually. I didn't expect them to put that twist on my little thing. I was hoping they'd do something like that, though. <laughs> Ahem. <clears throat> ah, now my boots. Alright, so what's in this portal? Oh no, you freed him. You're a terrible person. You should feel bad. Dang it. Well, I freed him. Oh shoot. Well, I can't keep the boot anymore. Dang. But I can't keep climbing up this ladder. Whoa! Will the planet of non dearlier now can thing? I can tell I haven't missed anything. Eight Flight Desolate Town, Blue Champ, Blue Surfer. The credits, huh? Yeah. I think that's it then. That's everything this game, this main game has to offer me. Can I go down? No, I can't. Oh, I can. Okay, so let's go down. Um, so I think that's the end of this mega long part. There's only one place left to go now. At least as far as I know. We go up here. We go inside the portal to the hub. And we enter. This, actually, no, 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 no. Well, yes. No, yes. Now I'm gonna... I guess I'll end it off <clears throat> at the castle of absolutely no significance, actually. Let's check to see what I've missed here. And by that, I mean let's check what I missed here in the next part. See you guys later.